All right, what's going on guys? Right now, looking at my videos here, I had an update. I just got a phone call that was pretty awesome. But looking at uh, my views, I know that I've got some OG guys in here, probably about 10 to 15 of you that looks like you're watching the majority of my videos or at least each one that come out. So I wanna say thank you to you guys individually. I mean, you're, you're literally a couple guys I'm pretty sure I've met, uh, at least one or two of you. Um, I've gotten a phone call from a couple of you, so I appreciate it, guys. Um, keep watching. We're going to have... Keep watching. We're going to have some really cool stuff coming out. Anyways, the phone call I just got was from How To. So they're an article like all three, 3DP and uh, uh, some of the other ones where they write articles, I guess, on How To. And they specifically are wanting some new articles on um, 3D printing. They've had one of their founders currently writing the articles for 3D printing, but they uh, they said that his full-time job is now taking him away from that, and they need some new stuff. So it'll be some freelance um, article writing. I've never done anything like that, but I do like to talk. I feel like I can uh, provide some good insight for 3D printing, and he thinks so too. Um, so we'll definitely be having Kristen, my girl, take care of the writing side of that. Uh, so she'll do all the proofreading. She'll do all the, uh, probably the actual writing of the article. She seemed pretty excited to do that. And I'll make sure that, that it's full of uh, good information that's useful. And she'll make sure it sounds good and entertaining. Um, so it should be a really good combo between the both of us writing the articles. And uh, I'm really excited for that. So hopefully you all will be able to check out how to here in the future and um, read some neat, useful articles um, written by us as well. So if, if YouTube's not enough, you can read about articles. <laughs> but I just thought that was super neat. Um, wanted to share that with you. It's, uh, you know, it's different things like this that will help, really help this business take off. So I'm pretty excited. I just had a client come by and pick up the Anycubic that was sitting here. He uh, was really impressed with the King Runes, so he bought an assembled one that was sitting uh, right there. So I'm about to take this one out of the box and put another one together. Um, to keep that rack moving and uh, we're gonna get that one going on a couple prints it's I'm gonna start having it do six prints at a time this one is still down unfortunately the screen is still doing nothing so there's nothing I can do with this guy I've asked for a formal refund on it I have someone that wants to buy one of these and I love it it's a good printer so um, we're gonna buy a new one of these and hopefully get that one returned properly um, this guy's still producing good stuff if you're curious so it does have a failure rate you know that one's considered unacceptable those all look good but there's a couple more in there that look pretty bad but uh, overall I let this run all weekend and that's what uh, it created if you look over here I think this is uh, is like this morning so it's probably about the same so, where the belt printer is cool, this bank of, uh, you know, a bunch of printers here can do what that did in a weekend in, you know, essentially half a shift of, of working. So, uh, Nozzles is going to win out over belt when it comes to uh, production. And that would probably be the case uh, for, for any $5,000 order. You would uh, probably see a winner... If we had, what, maybe 10 of these guys? We had, you know, one to the supervisor zone, nine, ten, a rack under it, and another rack up it. So if you had, like, 30 of them sitting here, that would probably be pretty nice for the production they would do 24-7. And I bet then it would outdo a rack of 10. But, um, anyways, apples and oranges. Uh, yeah, yeah, just super excited about what is happening, what we're doing. Um, just kind of... Showing what's going on around here. It's kind of neat. Got the big guy running up here. Doing, can't see the print yet, but yeah, there it is. It's doing a decent sized print. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, that's about all I got. I'm rambling on now. So thank you. Like, subscribe, share this video. Let's grow the channel some. Let's uh, get to the point of doing houses. If you want to see me fix this one, I'm probably going to do a video on it next. Maybe I can get it together shortly as well as that Prusa. So that's my goal right now. Thanks, guys.